Right now at five, a home engulfed in flames. I lived around the corner and on my way to work and saw the yellow tape. Two people inside found dead. Shock. I'm just in shock. Tonight, unraveling the mystery surrounding this fatal fire. And tonight, police are saying that fire was no accident. They say it was set as part of a murder-suicide. CBS 4's Joan Murray live on the scene with more on what police say happened. Joan. Well, this was such a raging fire. It took over 30 firefighters to contain. Take a look. You can see that this house sustained extensive damage. And late this afternoon, Fort Lauderdale police say that they believe the man who lived here shot his wife, set the house on fire, and then turned the gun on himself. Flames shot through the roof of this recently renovated home at 308 Southwest 22nd Street Thursday morning. When firefighters made their way in, they found the bodies of a man and woman. Fort Lauderdale investigators say the couple did not die from the fire, but believe it was a murder suicide, and the killer set the house ablaze. She was terrified of him somewhat, you know. I mean, he wasn't, I think she was filing for divorce or something. Neighbor Jeff Hall knew the couple who lived here. He took these pictures of the house burning and says he heard and saw the disturbing events unfold. And next thing I know, I hear a couple gunshots. I get up I, and I look out the window and the third gunshot, which was him, I saw the flash. And I'm like, oh, and I put on some clothes, ran out and I saw the flames and he had that door barricaded big time. I mean, it, it was three big guys trying to kick that door in. Neighbors and friends are in disbelief, unable to figure out how it could end like this. I'm just in shock. Steve Meyer says he knew the man who lived here and had to see for himself whether the deaths and fire actually happened. And when I turned around the corner, I saw all this, and 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 I heard, you know, while I was sleeping, I heard on the news there was a fire on 22nd, but I, I thought they said 400. Um, 22nd, Southwest 22nd, but it was this, it, it turned out to be this. And police are not releasing the identities of the victims. We understand family is still being notified out of town. In Fort Lauderdale, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News. Thank you, Joan.